I, James Peter Williams, take you, Natasha Hope Wedlake, to be my wife, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do part, according to God's holy law. In the presence of God, I make this vow. I, Natasha Hope Wedlake, take you, James Peter Williams, to be my husband, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health to love and to cherish, till death us do part, according to God's holy law. In the presence of God, I make this vow. Natasha, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share with you, within the love of God, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. James, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you, within the love of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. In the presence of God and before this congregation, James and Natasha have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together, let no one divide. James, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> <laughs> It wouldn't be a dad speech without a couple of words of advice thrown in. After all, I'm a dad, that's my job. And like all of my advice, it's given freely. And like all of my advice, Tasha will probably ignore it. But it's a special day, so you never know. Firstly, don't let life get in the way of love. Sometimes it's too easy to get wrapped up in the stuff of life. The house, shopping, work, family, all the usual rubbish. But boredom is the enemy of a good marriage. It's important to make time for yourselves and time for each other. Go to football, spend Saturdays at Wild Place, travel, see the world, even go to Disneyland if you must. Thank you for um, helping you. Um, you're the love of my life, you're my soulmate, you're my best friend. And that's all I can ask. What can I say? You are just absolutely amazing. Such a kind, loving, amazing person. And you've been there for me on my ups and my downs. And I just know that you're going to be a fantastic wife to James. So congratulations today on your wedding day. And for every day for the rest of your life. Because it's going to be fantastic and you're such an amazing person. So thank you. Thank you for having me here.